Hi, my name is Chris Hardy from RH Systems. In the next few minutes, I'm going to tell you a little bit about sulfur hexafluoride, or SF6, and what happens when it breaks down in gas insulated switchgear and breakers. I'm also going to tell you about the easiest, safest, and most effective way to test the quality of the SF6 in your breakers by using the RH Systems 973 SF6 analyzer. Stay tuned, I'll be right back. If you are in the electrical power industry, you already know how important it is to check the quality of the sulfur hexafluoride in your gas insulated switchgear and breakers. Here's a quick overview of how SF6 works and why its purity is so important to its performance. Sulfur hexafluoride, or SF6, is the most used insulating gas. It works by quenching arcs as contacts are opened and closed during the normal use of a switchgear and breaker. In fact, when that arc occurs, there's so much energy in that arc that the sulfur hexafluoride molecule actually breaks apart into sulfur and fluorine atoms. When the SF6 is extremely pure, the sulfur and fluorine atoms can reassemble back into an SF6 molecule. But if there are any impurities such as water in the gas, then the water can react with those individual atoms, creating a whole host of other chemicals, including things such as sulfur dioxide, or SO2, or hydrofluoric acid, HF, which is a very strong and toxic acid. If SF6 breaks down too much, your switchgear can be destroyed catastrophically at the worst or require very expensive repairs at the best. Regularly testing the quality of your SF6, as recommended by your switchgear manufacturer, is the most important thing you can do to keep these problems from happening. Now the most important test and the easiest test to run to test the quality of the SF6 is to measure the amount of water vapor. This is also called the dew point test. The team at RH Systems has developed the easiest and most intuitive SF6 gas analyzer on the market today, using our experience and technology that we have in our other dew point measurement products. The same ones that are used by leading calibration laboratories and metrology institutes worldwide. This is the RH Systems 973 SF6 analyzer. The 973 SF6 analyzer boasts a large, easy to read, full color touchscreen. It also has our innovative and powerful Intuit user interface. Even though this instrument is scientific grade and based on our laboratory instruments, the 973 SF6 analyzer was designed from the ground up for field use by maintenance personnel. We built it to be simple, powerful, and intuitive. It lets maintenance personnel do what they do best without forcing them to become scientists. Let me show you the 973 SF6 in action. Before you start your first run, you can check which test will be run by clicking on the dark gray soft key until control setup is shown. Then by clicking on the measuring options button, you can choose which test to run. For this run, we'll be measuring humidity and percent volume SF6. The 973 SF6 analyzer can also automatically pump back to the switchgear or breaker after the measurement is completed. I'll turn this off for now and show you how it works later. If everything looks okay, click OK. Before we start a run, we first want to make sure that any hoses and lines are evacuated of air. Otherwise, our measurement may be off due to humidity in the environment. Click Evacuate Hose to purge the line. Follow the instructions and click OK. Pop-up windows are shown whenever some action needs to happen before the unit can proceed. We've designed this unit to reduce the risk of improper use and to help your maintenance personnel do what they do best. And even better, our Intuit user interface is designed to be intuitive to use without requiring users to read and memorize a lengthy manual just to use this instrument. Once the instrument is done pumping down, you're ready to start a measurement. You do this by clicking the Start button. As you can see, we've created safety pop-ups to alert you when something's wrong. In this case, I haven't opened the valve to the vessel, so let me do that, and then we can click OK. Now let's press Start. The 973 SF6 has a built-in pump, which draws gas out of the container and passes it over the measuring head. The measuring head is rapidly cooled using Peltier elements, creating an extremely cold surface that the SF6 must pass over. 
if there's any water vapor in the gas, it will begin to condense out, forming either dew or frost. This is similar to how dew forms on your car window early in the morning. Once dew is detected on the mirror, the 973SF6 precisely adjusts the temperature of the mirror in order to find the exact point at which the dew or frost layer reaches an equilibrium with the SF6 gas. In other words, the 973SF6 finds a point where the dew or frost layer doesn't grow or shrink. The temperature of the mirror at that point is called the dew point. Once the dew point is determined, the instrument then goes into SF6 purity mode and uses its three-stage Peltier element to determine the SF6 concentration by using a similar technique. Once each measurement is complete, check marks will appear next to each measurement and the values will be updated on the screen. You may have noticed the internal chamber measurement rising during the run. The 973SF6 analyzer has an integrated internal cylinder where it stores the SF6 that was used during the run. This instrument is environmentally friendly and does not release any SF6 into the environment. It is also fully compliant with SF6 environmental emissions regulations around the world. Now you have two options for handling the SF6 in the internal cylinder. The first option is to pump the gas back to the switch gear asked for each run, which is what most of our customers prefer to do. You do this by simply pressing the pump button. The second option is to let the 973SF6 analyzer store two to three runs worth of SF6 in the internal cylinder, and then you can pump the SF6 to your on-site holding tank for recycling, again, just by pushing the pump button. By using the chilled mirror effect, the 973SF6 is based upon the physics of water condensation. This sets it apart from other SF6 analyzers on the market in a few very important ways. First, the 973SF6 has no humidity sensors. Therefore, there are no humidity sensors to replace or recalibrate. Second, that also means that this instrument is more stable and more reliable than humidity sensor-based instruments. Third, by using physics rather than humidity sensors, this instrument is capable of making humidity measurements that do not drift. And finally, we have been able to design this instrument in a way that the calibration can be field verified by any user at any time. Let me show you how that works. Using the built-in ice test, you can be confident in the instrument and verify its performance at any time. Click on the dark gray soft key until control setup appears. Then click on ice test. The instrument will walk you through the steps. First, open the measuring head by unscrewing the cover. Then remove the optic module. Press OK. The mirror will cool to the point where frost forms on it. The instrument will start to beep as it warms back up to room temperature. Watch the mirror. When it reaches the melting point of ice, 0 degrees C, the mirror will go from a dull gray to a bright reflective silver. Press OK when the mirror changes. The instrument will tell you pass, meaning that the humidity measurement is working correctly, or fail, meaning that the humidity measurement may be having trouble. You can repeat this test as often as you like to verify that your RH system's 973SF6 analyzer is performing properly. Maintenance of the RH system's 973SF6 is limited to two simple tasks. First, to clean the mirror, simply unscrew the measuring head, remove the optical module, and use the included sterile cotton swabs to wipe the mirror clean. Then reassemble the measuring head. The next step is to test the performance of the sampling hose. To do this, click evacuate hose. The instrument will pump down to 0.2 bar and then just monitor the vessel pressure over a few minutes and see if it increases substantially. Your 973 SF6 analyzer comes to you ready for action. 
Packaged inside this custom-built Pelican case, we've included a stainless steel braided Teflon sampling hose, DN8 and DN20 adapters, a 90-degree quick connect adapter, cabling should you wish to hook your 973 SF6 up to a computer, cotton swabs for cleaning the measuring head, a tool for installing or replacing an SO2 module, the owner's manual, and the certificate of calibration. The 973 SF6 is available in a large number of languages and can also be configured to support any country's electrical power configuration. If you wish to learn more about the 973 SF6 or to request a quote, please give us a call at area code 505-856-5766. You can also reach me or anyone on our sales team at sales at rhs.com. Thank you very much. I look forward to hearing from you.